this is Gay Pan for Goat. Hey, who let that goat out? <laughs> so hi, they play some more Hussy Priand. And today we're going to go and do a bit of exploring and get to a red barrel and gun ult damage times two. And also, you may be wondering why I'm not moving too much. Is because there's a skeleton, a new type of skeleton, and they have 50 bits of health. And they also hit you with a bow and arrow. So a good way of dealing with them is from far away enough so they can't get you. But yeah, again, so you can get them. There. He's gone and now there's a skeleton all the way up there. Oh, got him. But he's still not enough for him to go away. You know, die. But that one sure is enough. And there, I believe that's all these skeletons. It's around here. Oh, nope. I'm wrong. Bone well, arrows are pretty good against. You don't bow and arrows, okay? <laughs> I mean, the Wood McGuffin is pretty good against them. But, anyways, yeah, let's see. Go up here. And we've already pressed this button before, I believe, right? We already have. Now, there's a chest that we have not gotten yet. Been down through here. And there, now well, I have even more health from the health that I've already lost due to those skeletons. Is all. Well, uh, not to. There, let's jump down. And we are also going to place a force cube on here. Or behind the little later, but we're going to do some stuff whilst we're here. So this makes that to move out of the way, because this. That platform is going to be in the way. Yeah, okay, I guess I can't. So, you guys, what I'm going to be doing. And now, don't you reach the skeleton which just appeared? There it is. It's going to kill them. Get their coins. Oh, this one went running. Alright, <laughs> they can't run forever, yay. <laughs> but, anyways, it's going to do what I wanted to do. Who saw me? This guy. Yeah, I don't think enemies can hit me up here. And yes, they're soldiers of uh, spear firing skeleton guys. And, oh, nope, wrong timing. <laughs> what? Missed. How falls on it? Uh oh. I'll do it right now. <laughs> the skeleton's here. And now this soldier skeleton guy. Eh, now. Yes, hopefully you'll stop attacking me for more than two minutes. And now fire through there. And... Perfect, you did. But anyways, now we're going to go and do the reason why I uh, put in that force cube there. Now. So we need to stop on, uh, on these platform things. No reason there. Perfect, now it's the white height. I can now jump onto here and jump over to here. So we were here just a few minutes ago. But now, this door is open due to that force key piercing, which made it so we can get to this red moon. And uh, we're also going to go and stomp here. There. Made it. Okay. Now we're up here, we have some coins and a little chest in here. This is filled to the point with coins. Okay, so oh, hang on. Now we're going to go and jump down. And now we are very soon going to be seeing the real shop. 
that. So we shot at that to activate that launch pad over there. But you won't be using today. But it's rare. Just in case we do need to use it. Every later. We'll store rare. So we're going to stop on this. Because you'll make it so you're forced to look at that. that or you can just be way past it. <laughs> can I show you? <laughs> but anyways. Now. You see this gas? We, we can stomp gas with my stomp shoes. And this guy be used the same kind that we saw with the shells with the cooking crystal stuff. And I think he has that stuff in this barrel. Well, because bee stuff is coming out of it, bee smoke, because that will have gas time. Bee smoke. And also a gas mask he also had. <laughs> so anyways, let's open this chest which is filled even more to the brim or that it's just 20 times bigger. <laughs> or you know, just a lot bigger. Just going and getting them all. Because whatever we ask, one of these. And they're perfect, that's all of them. And we can also open this. And also, he's wondering if I've heard about knocking, and I do know about knocking, okay? <laughs> but, anyways. Oh, what's this grave? Should we go and destroy it? Nice down here. Because graves are bad, because they spawn more enemies. <laughs> but, anyways, let's go back up here. Because we. I need to go and shoot that, which will activate that up there. So we need to press this button, and we only have limited time. Just going to try and shoot it in that general direction. That did it. I think I got it a few times there. There is, I should go and push it activate this. And also, I have a strategy for this one being that, well, it's hard, hard sometimes because you can't jump past or doing that up onto it. But you can go on this little platform and jump onto it. This means that you can do double jump and triple jump. If you so need it to. But it's nearest. Okay, and there's two ways to get up to that platform because we want to get up to it. That's simple. I put a force cube on it. So one way, which is the way I'm going to do it, is by going and yonk here on this pipe. And we, there we go. And another way, which also use the oat buckle, you can go on here, activate it, a quick key one on here, and then you'll go on here and then you can go up. Both ways work. You choose whichever one you want. <laughs> So anyways, this big little button leads to this door and it will stay on with anything touches onto it. And well this pipe seems to actually have a bit of a launch pad on it. <laughs> yeah, fires out the weird stuff which is like a bit of a launch pad. Because there's a launch pad. The pipe. <laughs> Basically. So we can go and hit on the button. Hit the button. Okay, so this guy says that we have everything to solve this, which is true, because I have my gun, which can uh, explode when we hit it with a beam, and here's the red barrel, and inside this chest is gun lot to damage times two. Let's go and pick it up. <laughs> but anyways, bye!